Manor, Concord, took off for the last time carrying paying passengers, ending almost 30 years of service and it may have seemed that the era of the Superjet was over. Since then, plans for a replacement have come and gone, but conventional subsonic aircraft have dominated the skies, getting bigger like the A380 Airbus rather than faster. Enter a small British company who has developed a new hyperfast plane called the A2, using engines fueled by hydrogen that will span the globe in just four hours, flying more than twice as fast and carrying three times the payload of Concorde. The A2, for example, carries three times as many passengers. Its engines have been designed so that uh, it's quiet on takeoff, it can cruise efficiently subsonically. Um, before going hypersonic over ocean areas and uh, overall the range is now global. It's not just a matter of can we make it across the Atlantic to America. This aeroplane can fly with range to spare right around the planet. The technological breakthrough that has allowed the development of the A2 hypersonic plane is the engine design which can operate like a conventional air-breathing jet at low altitudes and switch to the power of a rocket at the edge of space. Using supercooled hydrogen for fuel, the reaction engine can achieve speeds in excess of Mach 5. That's almost 4,000 miles an hour. We're in the process of building a team of uh, European aerospace uh, companies and we're about to start the next uh, stage of our program. And uh, for reaction engines, this will involve uh, building a small uh, pre-cooler, which is the key sort of new technology within the engine, and running that in, in front of a small jet engine at our test site here at uh, Cullum. So that, that really is the sort of uh, key sort of next stage uh, in the technical program. 